Rome, the Colosseum, those sun-drenched piazzas, the whole postcard picture. Now forget all that. We're going deeper, darker, and way older. Because underneath the city you know, there's another Rome entirely. This one's made of shadows and whispers. Picture this, a network of tunnels, tombs, ancient sewers. A whole maze built over centuries, layer upon layer. Forget organized tours, this is more like an underground jungle. Some are grand. Emperors built secret palaces down here. Rooms where gold glittered in the gloom. Remember Nero, the crazy one? Yep, had a whole party pad underground. The Domus Aria, they call it. But here's the creepy part. The catacombs, miles of tunnels lined with the dead. Early Christians, persecuted by Rome, they buried their people down here, carved prayers into the stone. Imagine the courage that took, working by candlelight under a city that wanted them gone. Why build underground? Rome got crowded, needed space. Plus, it's cool down there, literally. Perfect for storing stuff back when fridges didn't exist. And during wartime, those tunnels became escape hatches, hideaways. People spent days, even weeks in the dark, hoping the enemy above wouldn't find them. Some parts are flooded, others caved in, Explorers still find stuff no one's seen for centuries. Graffiti 2,000 years old. Lost temples of forgotten gods. It's like a time machine. Only you have to get a little dirty to use it. Now imagine the smells. Damp stone. A whiff of something unidentifiably old. The echoes of your footsteps as you descend the stone stairs. That feeling like the past is breathing down your neck. Not just a history lesson, this is history you can practically touch. Think about it. Under all that bustling modern life is a silent city, waiting. Kind of makes you wonder what secrets lie beneath your feet, doesn't it?